Okay guys, what's up? It's Nick from MigratIphone.com and I just wanted to make this real quick video and as you can see I do have a Mac now so I might start doing some Mac tutorials, um, I'm not sure yet I'll have to take up with the team but we never know what's going to go on so yeah, I've got a Mac and I just wanted to make this real quick video because I've had a lot of questions um, saying when I download the IPSW to jailbreak on the 3.1.3 firmware that it is zipped up or like if I unzip it there's no firmware left in there so I wanted to shoot this quick video to answer those questions so I hope this helps now the main reason you're probably getting it in a zip file is probably because you're using Safari so I've got Safari right here now um, Safari basically zips up your files now if you're on Windows or, or um, Mac uh, and you use Safari, uh, first thing I would say is try a different um, Internet Explorer. So like Google Chrome or Firefox or even Internet Explorer. Try one of them and see if that works. If not, then I also have another step for you. So the way to stop it with Safari would be open up Safari. You then go to your toolbar at the top and it says Safari or on Windows. Um, it should say uh, file or something like that. I can't remember now, even though I was a Windows user like a day ago. Um, but you'll know what I mean. You go to Safari and you go to preferences and you'll get this. Okay, so let's just minimize that so you can see this. Okay, so once you get to here, this box right here will be ticked. What you want to do is just untick it it will say open safe files after downloading you just want to untick that like so and you're good to go guys so if I was to go and then download a firmware in Safari uh, so I'm up, I'm on my YouTube channel and I'm watching how to jailbreak 3.1.3 uh, firmware right here just pause that and I go to the link which I gave you guys okay so if I wanted to download a firmware for my iPhone 3.1.3 I would download it and as you can see right there it is not in a zip it is ha it has that little cube so already I know I have that firmware not zipped and ready to use so I'm going to stop that and uh, actually delete it off the list Okay, so that's pretty much it, guys. I just hope that helped uh, answer the questions from all of you guys that have been asking. I've had a lot of questions about zipped, zipped up and all that stuff. So I hope that really helped, guys, and I'll catch you guys real soon in the next video.